everybody welcome back to my channel it is me zoe and yeah um you will be seeing soon a walkthrough of my bath matrix outlet store i have two or kind of near me here on a route we travel often so i went to the one that's farther away but yeah i'm going to insert the walkthrough here So now for the haul, I got a full bag, or I got a really full bag, and mom got a full bag as well, and if you can hear my parents talking or music, I'm sorry, my parents are talking and my brother's playing music, and yeah, I can't really get a quiet time ever apparently. Anyways, <laughs> let's go ahead and get started. I did have a 10 off 40 coupon, and my mom had the 25% off and the pocket bag coupon, so yeah, let's go, get, go ahead and get started with my stuff. So the first thing I got is the Pure Wonder Fine Fragrance Mist. I only grabbed this because I had to grab something quick to get to the $40 point without tax to get the 10 off 40. It smells really good. Um, the notes are Ice Rosé, Starter as Mint, and Warm White Amber. I already have this one back there. Um, but this one, the juice is actually pink and the one of mine is clear or very much lighter pink, so I don't know <laughs> why it's different, but I think it's supposed to be pink, so I don't know what I paid for that, but I can see, let's see, I paid $3.33, so, and that was originally $17.50. The next thing I got is one of the blend candles. This is a Cinnamon Spice Vanilla and Paris Cafe. I've been obsessed with coffee candles recently and here is the wick placement it smells so good it definitely has like a cinnamony latte smell and it smells amazing 
Let's see. Okay, that came out to $4.59. It was originally $15.50, but it was on the $6 select items table. So yeah, I got that for $4.59. That smells amazing. And I also picked up a pocket bag to try to get to that for dollar mark. I picked up the Ho 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 Sparkling Icicles pocket bag. And with the um, 10 off 40, it came down to 37 cents and it was 75 cents off. I don't know what this is gonna smell like because it doesn't really say what it's gonna smell like. <laughs> and it's burning my nose. It's like a, I feel like it's a pure wonder scent, but if you take out like, the rosé smell. It's kind of like that. It's a little masculine, but I shall use it. Okay, the next thing I got was actually to stock up on my um, fall body care because if you just saw my last video, I reorganized my fall body care and I have way less fall body care than I thought I did. And fall is a pretty long season. So, or like, okay, fall is not a longer season than any other, so, but I love fall, so I got some more fall items. First, the first thing I got is the Champagne Apple and Honey Fine Fragrance Mist. In my walkthrough, you should have seen there this one and the Festive Packaging. I actually asked my mom which one she liked better, and she said the Festive Packaging, but Festive Packaging be a little tacky. So I got this one. Or no, she said she liked this one better, but I liked the Festive Packaging, but I don't really inspire to have a collection of that, and I don't want to encourage their use of festive packaging and everything. So I didn't get that. Um, the notes are Pink Lady Apple, Sparkling Champagne, and Jasmine Honey. And let's see for that one. I paid $2.29 after my count of 40 because it was on the $3 table. So yeah, we're gonna spray this on. Let's see what it smells like. Oh, the lid does have a slight pink tint. And it's super cute. I like this scent a lot more than I thought it did, but yeah, it's a crisp, sweet, slightly floral, perfumey apple scent, and I really do like that. So I got that one. The next thing I got is, again, another apple scent. I guess I'm turning into an apple scent lover. This is Winter Candy Apple. Again, this is $2.29. Um, I have the scrub for this um, that matches this packaging, I think. So yeah, I decided to get this one. The notes are Candy Red Apple, Winter Rose Petals, and Candied Orange. Okay. So I this on, and I really do like this apple scent. The packaging is super cute. Um, I think they nailed the packaging, and Winter Candy Apple has really never lost its strong scent, but Vanilla Bean Noel has, so. Yeah, it's a strong, just like crisp, but also like, I don't know, it's cozy in a way that's hard to explain. I just love that, and apparently I like absolutely love apple scents now. <laughs> Next thing was the Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte Body Cream. I recently did a giveaway on, I think it was YouTube, I think. No, it's, it was either YouTube or Instagram. I have no idea that I gave away a scrub for this. Um, I don't regret that at all, but I do like this scent a lot. The notes are Pumpkin Latte, Toaster Marshmallow, Creamy Sandal, and a Praline Musk. Again, this is the other table, so I got it for $2.29. It smells amazing, and let's see how this was made. This was made in the 161st day of 2021. So it is over a year old, but that's okay because I'll be using it up next year, so it'll be just about two years old. Yeah, it smells so good. It's just a sweet, soft, um, like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's not really pumpkin-y and it's not really latte. It's just kind of like a marshmallow scent, so there's that. I also decided to pick up the mist in this. Again, it was $2.29. Let's put this on to see the packaging, or the strength. And I actually have, I think I have almost all of this collection that was in this packaging, except the blueberry sugar pancakes in this packaging, but I have it in the new packaging. Yeah, it smells very marshmallow-y. So if you want a marshmallow scent, this is the one to go to. There's not much pumpkin, there's not like any latte. It's pretty much just marshmallow. Along with that, I decided to pick up the Champagne Apple and Honey Body Cream. And this one was made in the 153rd day of 2021, so I might have to use this one like late August. But this one is very, is very white compared to Marshall Pumpkin Latte, 
which is very yellow, but that could be the vanilla content. So yeah, again, it's just a soft yet perfumey, beautiful, beautiful apple scent. And it honestly is super pretty packaging. So yeah. Okay. The next thing is another pocket bag. I grabbed the winter candy apple pocket bag. I guess the pair of that. And you know what? I totally thought, like totally thought that I grabbed another coconut candy apple mist. I seriously thought I did. And I'm gonna check my mom's bag to see. Yeah, I I know I put that mist in the bag. I don't know how it got out. Things like that always happen, so who knows. <laughs> but I meant to get another coconut candy apple mist because I adore that scent, but it is usually readily available at the outlets, so yeah. Oh, I forgot. The notes are on the bottoms of these candles. Um, the notes are rich roasted coffee, vanilla creme, and ground cinnamon for the Cinnamon Swiss Vanilla and Paris Cafe. And I also grabbed toasted pineapple marshmallow because I really enjoy the wallflower. The notes are fresh pineapple, milk chocolate, toasty marshmallows, and graham cracker. Yeah, it does have a chocolatey, slightly soft, like, pineapple cake smell. It smells amazing, and I do love me some candles, and if you saw... No, you see my candle collection, it has grown quite a bit since then. And um, I'm not sorry, but I, I think because of a lack of like new body care or other scents of body care at the outlet on sale, I've recently been getting into candles and it might be another problem, but we'll, we'll get there when I get there. Um, then I got chocolate banana mudslide. I said I would get this if I saw it again and I did as you saw in the video, obviously. This one has the normal lid. I was gonna switch it out, but I'm like, that's kind of a stupid thing to do. So there's the wick placement. It is a chocolatey, buttery candle, and I do love it. Um, the notes are frozen bananas, chocolate syrup, crushed ice, and splash of rum. So the rum I'm smelling is probably like the um, buttery smell. You smell syrup and maybe a hint of like a chocolate or banana. So I do absolutely love this. It's a sweet, sweet candle. And I think the label's kind of ugly, but totally fine okay um and those candles were ten dollars and i don't know how much i got them for they were ten dollars and with my 10 off 40 i got them for 764 so it was basically a 25 percent off Coupon. okay now onto the stuff my mom grabbed the first thing she grabbed was um this is the champagne toast refill bag um i don't know what the notes are for this one but it's like champagne and berries and that's pretty much it so i don't know how many this refills it says three times but um my mom likes to put a little water in this because she thinks they're too foamy so let's probably get like five and we did pick that up and that came down to two dollars and 25 cents with their 25 percent off coupon and then she decided to pick up the sun kiss to find frankensmith i don't think this is for her i think this is for a gift this is sun drenched orange blossom sparkling sea salt and vanilla breeze and this was two dollars and ninety cents because it was on 75 percent off she also grabbed for herself a fall body care in sunrise with body cream she got the creamy sandal sorry the nose on creamy sandal with sweet berries and cozy cashmere i love the scent and it is very pretty and i think she'll love it obviously she offered 225. she also picked up a gift for my grandma she picked up the love cotton candy champagne and then it's our bubbly rosé sweet strawberry and pink sugar Again, this came down to $2.50 because it's on a $2 table. So that's an amazing, amazing deal. She also picked up, I'm not sure for herself, maybe for a gift, Buttercups and Berry Bellini. The notes are Strawberry Puree, Buttercup Flowers, and Bubbly Prosecco. Um, $2.53 after discount. And she had a free pocket bag. She got the sport one for the car because um, the boys in our family do not like any of the pocket bag smells that aren't men's stuff so she got that so they're not like being overly dramatic in the car anyways and that was free and then let's see she got a plain white wallflower plug for behind um their bed my mom and dad um came out with 337 25% off of 450 so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this and enjoyed the walkthrough i know it probably wasn't the best quality and I should have put a voiceover over it. And I hope you guys do like that. Um, yeah, I kind of covered my fear. There wasn't 
a whole bunch of people around me but i hope you guys liked it and it gave you a good idea what's on my outlet so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you later bye